Do you have any sort of favourite soap personalities or characters here tonight? Well, I don't know whether they're here and I love Norris. I would say Coronation Street. I think he's absolutely wonderful because if I lived next door to him, I'd strangle him. <laughs> I'd, I'd strangle him. No, he's one. But all the performances, Steve McDonald's at the moment is doing superb work. Yeah. And what sort of, can you pick out a few sort of soap highlights that have been for you, even if it's from rival soaps? From this year or just kind of forever? Yeah, forever. Yeah, I think I think I like all the very dramatic storylines. I think um, where they have explosions and they've had explosions on the, in the shop down the street before. Do you remember that one? That was probably the most exciting one for me. Um, yeah. I think I think the most dramatic one of the last of the last sort of few years is the train crash in Coronation Street. The photography and the way how that was done was unbelievable. You know, you really felt. So that train was coming in, you know, and the devastation and the performances, it was wonderful, absolutely. And of course, you've got a historic soap connection yourself. I mean, do you still look back fondly on those Brookside days? I love it. I love it. I think we were cutting edge in them days. We were. You know, I think we were the first ones to swear and first ones to have a lesbian kiss and the first ones to have a little little niddle at the Catholic Church, Phil Redmond. But you know, in them days, what made it so good was the writers. We had Jimmy McGovern, John Godber, Kay Meller, Andy Lynch, all superb writers. And the writing makes it, doesn't it? As actors, we only try and do it justice, you know? Did you get a chance to catch Sue on screen when she was in Curry? I got a phone call the other day from Lord Grantham, from Downton Abbey. It was Sue Johnson winding me up <laughs> with Hugh Bonneville. It was, yeah. I'm lying in bed nine o'clock in the morning. Saying, Hello, this is Lord Grantham here. How dare you? <laughs> but that's the way it is. We're all great mates in the business, yeah. And we must ask, royal families, that kind of over uh, revival? Oh, I, I think there's a real good chance that we, we'll do one now. That, thank God, and I mean that, thank God Caroline's over her illness and she's on the mend and she's doing tremendous and Craig's doing well, so fingers crossed, eh?